while people are repairing damage from Hurricane Ian that happened more than a year ago, the storm damage that caused the damage that's flooding the streets today. It's definitely another nuisance as neighbors on Fort Myers Beach look to rebuild their home. Wakey's reporter Olivia Jean joins us live now from Fort Myers Beach. And Olivia, tonight there's some relief for the neighbors out there. Absolutely, there is some relief. The people that I've spoken to on Fort Myers Beach say they are upset that this project didn't happen sooner. One woman that lives on this street told me that it's normal to see a foot of water when it rains. Rain, rain, go away, they say, but not for everyone on Fort Myers Beach. Heavy rains or a surge, even a light surge, our entire street will flood from Sterling to Seminole Way. And what I'm told is that we're one of the lowest parts on the island, so it's really bad for us. It could be a big storm in this area. All through here is always just flooded. Yeah. Standing water, and there's standing water all up the street. Keith is not alone in feeling frustrated. I talked with many neighbors who feel his pain. Seminole Way and Pepita Street are the two streets that have been named a priority for this project. Those on Pepita told me they experience a small amount of flooding, but those on Seminole Way told me it's been bad for years. It goes right up your driveway, right through, and it floods. In addition to the two streets that have been named a priority, 17 other streets are getting flood improvements too. The construction is supposed to start at any moment with the last street finished at the end of August. I lost cars, I lost everything in my house, my appliances. Some neighbors even told me that before it rains, they move their cars to higher ground. Carol told me her and her neighbors have been speaking out about this issue for years. Whole last year and the year before, no one ever came down Sterling or Seminole, so it kept skipping our streets. That's when I started like going to town meetings and like, hey, what about us? No one's come down here. And she said, I'm so happy, but I'll believe it when it happens because only because they tell you one thing and it just never happens. Yeah. So when it happens, I'll believe it when it happens. All right. You can see some of the damage right here, and it hasn't rained for a couple of days. There's some perspective for you. Construction trucks are going to be filling up these streets pretty soon. If you want a full list of the approved streets for this project, visit winknews.com. Live in Fort Myers Beach, I'm Olivia Jean, Wink News.